So I'm sure 99% of you have seen the Conor Bradley tackle from last night. If you haven't, here it is. And a back pace off the net, accelerating, and a cross comes Conor Bradley. Anfield has just erupted at that young man. Look at that, in the Champions League, Conor Bradley playing for Liverpool against Real Madrid. He had Mbappe in his back pocket. I didn't know which shirt would be suitable for today's video, so I've gone for the Northern Ireland shirt. The Northern Ireland shirt is going an absolute screamer in against Scotland. I'll put that in the video now. And Bradley! A stunner from Conor Bradley, Northern Ireland's boy wonder. Yeah, Conor Bradley has come on leaps and bounds since he signed for Bolton. Ever since he signed for Bolton, he played his first pre-season game for us at Longridge Town where we won. Where we won 9-0 in a pre-season friendly. Conor Bradley that game showed his absolute class and what potential he had to offer. Uh, someone actually commented on that video. I shall read that out now and I'll also put it on screen. David Green, if you're watching, you'll remember commenting this on my video. Thanks, Ben, for showing the goals. You've become the go-to for our goals. Opinion on Connor Bradley. I responded to that saying, class on that right-hand side with Gethin Jones and Morley. He looks a promising player. I was very right that day. Since then, he's developed massively. In his season at Bolton, you know, you know what they say, never fall in love with a lone player. But we fell for that. But he, he won some things with us. He won the Papa John's Trophy. On that night in Barnsley, we couldn't get through to Wembley. Uh, but Barnsley got through and they lost. And we met them again the year after. Uh, but yeah, Conor Bradley and James Trafford, what a duo that was in League One. You know, Trafford is now at Burnley in the Championship. When he signed for Burnley, they were in the Premier League. But Conor Bradley has gone back to his home club at Liverpool. And now, now he started last night and he's, he's playing brilliantly, uh, I've got to admit. So yeah, this video is basically just looking back on Conor Bradley and where he started and where he is now. The first time I remember seeing Conor Bradley was at Longridge. And I really thought he had some potential for us. Uh, he showed that in the season. In his first Carabao Cup game for Bolton, he scored a screamer against Salford. I'll put that in the video now. As you can see, took that on his right foot, top corner. Absolutely fantastic finish. Um, I think that ended up 4-1 to us. Yeah, he played for Bolton for one season, scoring five goals in total, four of them in League One, one of them being in the Carabao Cup, and that was against Salford. Conor Bradley was a big part to play in our playoff push. Um, he got us there. He helped us get there. Without him, we probably wouldn't have got there, to be honest. He just showed his class, and he was above everybody else, really. I mean, he had his off game, but everyone has their off game. I know that season with us gave him some fantastic experience. And if you're a Liverpool fan now, I'm sure you can agree with me that he's got so much potential. He's playing in the first team for Liverpool. That's fantastic. That's a fantastic achievement for any footballer. For someone that's played for Bolton in the past, we're always looking out for him, always watching, see how he's doing. I mean, look at Dapo. Dapo, all of Dapo half a lion. Look at him now. He's in the Bundesliga now playing for St. Pauli. They're a, they're a good team. They won the Bundesliga 2 last season. Uh, he, he played a big part in that team as well. If there's any Liverpool fans watching this, please let me know in the comments what you think of Conor Bradley. Do you think he's going to be a first-team starter? Do you reckon he's going to become comfortable in your squad? I made this video just to reflect on how good he's become. Conor Bradley's played a massive part in, in the Northern Ireland squad this year. In the Nations League, uh, they won the group. He's a fan favourite. Everyone loves him. I mean, it's the same with Dion Charles. He's a week-in, week-out goal scorer. He's scoring for Northern Ireland. He's scoring for Bolton. He's, uh, he's, he's another one that you should look out for in the future. Um, my favourite memory of Conor Bradley is at, um, is at the Salford game where he scored that screamer. Uh, I remember the, uh, the playoff second leg um, after we'd just lost to Barnsley. I remember him coming over to the fans, clapping us, and uh, all the fans were singing his name. There's only one Conor Bradley. There is only one Conor Bradley and he's at Liverpool now. And if you have enjoyed this video, please make sure to subscribe. If you're a Bolton fan, you're Northern Irish, you're from Liverpool, you're from, I don't know, Real Madrid. As well, Conor, if this video makes it to you, all the best, mate. You're doing a fantastic job keeping up. Anybody, make sure to drop us a subscribe. I really appreciate your support. The comments on the videos recently have been fantastic. I couldn't attend the Tuesday night game away at Cambridge. Um... We didn't get a result. I don't really like saying this about not attending a game, but I kind of dodged a bullet there. Uh, there's no game this weekend, but I'll be back next Tuesday, as usual, at Mansfield at home. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. All the best. Bye, guys.